Good morning, Chris. Ross Curtis here with Northside Mitsubishi. Just want to do a quick video walkthrough of the 14 Durango that you inquired about. Going to have the 3.6 liter V6 engine. Uh, all wheel controls, another option on this one, which is definitely nice for the winter. Looking to the front, do get the chrome styling with the fog lights. Uh, HID headlights, lights up the road pretty well. Just to give you a quick pan out here, I'll go through the options in the back and in the interior. It's going to be coming with your 20 inch wheels and it does come with your TPMS sensors so you're going to know when you're getting a flat before you're completely flat. Uh, lockable uh, gas cap there just to make sure everything's secure. Uh, taking a look to the back here is going to get the, the rear defrost with the wiper and the sprayer. No need to scrape anything and that does activate your side mirrors as well. Now this guy is going to be the seven seater. Fair bit of cargo back here. Uh, those seats do hold, fold down. I uh, do get power outlets back here, as well as a built-in flashlight, which is a very nice touch. Um, under the under storage, under here, and your full spare tire. Just gonna close this up. Taking a look to the back seat, Chris. Um, you get your foldable head headrest, so you can see past them. Um, Drop-down middle console with the cup holders, and obviously heater options in the back. You do get uh, control of of the temperature in the back, uh, fully lit up. It does get come with the fast key technology, so it is a proximity sensor. You are able to open the door and close the door, lock it, unlock it without pulling the keys out of your pocket. Now taking a look here, you do get the power seat options with the lumbar support. Full power options on your door, power door locks, power mirrors, and power windows. Um, taking a look to the steering wheel, you get your cruise control settings, your menu options, and your Bluetooth. It's actually you connect through Dodge, but uh, same thing, going to link up to your phone, is going to be pushed to start. Uh, taking a look, huge amount of options on the dash, you can control just about everything on this on this truck. It does have outside temperature, um, full CD player here, all your uh, auxiliary, USB and SD card as well as another power. Uh, Dodge has switched to the dial style, unlike the old one with the actual shifter, something I'm really liking. Uh, Taking a look back here, huge amounts of space. Um, can't say enough about these Durangos. They do have a lot, a lot of room. Um, as far as your climate options, do have front and rear defrost, uh, two-tier console with power outlets in there, and your spot to hang your cord. Um, when you do turn the lights on in this one, you do get the uh, lit up cup holders. So if you're driving at night, easy spot to uh, to find your coffee. Now taking a look here, the other thing I really like about these Durangos is, is they put the paddle shifters on the steering wheel, not on the column itself. So when you're driving, if you do need that sport mode, you know, you can kick in and out of it without having to straighten the wheel. Um, all your full rear wiper controls are in here. And definitely, uh, definitely gonna be a nice unit. I drive a seven seater as well, and I probably wouldn't go back. Anyway, I'll give you one more pan out here, Chris. We do have this unit on Ad Special. We're looking to get it out, and we're looking to get a, give a great deal on it. So give me a shout back at 780-479-5700, and we can go from there. Thanks, Chris. Have a great day.